Anthony, back with a YouTube video. I didn't tell by the title. I'm here to talk about Battlefield 2042. Now, there's lots of people on Twitter saying, because because of the, the play the beta, that the game should be delayed again. No. Do not delay the game again. Main reason why? This happened on other games, by the way. Um, when a game gets delayed, the less hype it gets. So, it's currently scheduled to be released on November the 19th, which is literally next month. So, 30, about 40 days away. 40 days away. Now, this is what betas are for. You report the bugs, the company fixes them. Now, the bugs that were in the beta, they were, they were just like minor, minor, minor bugs. Yes, there were a lot of bugs. I do agree there was. There was a lot of bugs. So, for example, one of the bugs would be a, a building disappearing now and again. The sky, but like, turning colours all the time. You know, stuff like that. So I wouldn't say it's like, the game looks great. It looks it looks amazing. The game looks 10 out of 10 when it comes to graphically. It looks insane how good it looks. It's, it's incredible how good it looks. So, graphically, the game isn't broken. But there is a few bugs that need fixing. Now, that'll only take, that, that won't take them long. It really, really won't. There's no need to delay the game until next year. Because if they do do that, the, the game will get, you know, less hype. Now, don't get me wrong. If the game looked terrible, if it didn't look good, if it didn't play well, fair enough. But when it comes to minor bugs, such as buildings disappearing, um, the sky changing, you know, they're really fixable. They can fix it. Every game that launches will have bugs. It's inevitable. Same with single player games. Every, whenever a game launches, it has bugs. You know what I mean? So, if they do delay it again, it'll be a big oof. It will be. Uh, it, won't, it won't be good. It really won't. Now, don't forget this one. We've got Call of Duty Vanguard coming out literally next month. 5th of November it comes out. Now, the, that, that bait there, whew, that was broken. You couldn't, hear, you couldn't hear any footsteps. The sound was just fully broken. Um... So Call of Duty Vanguard, uh, take, you know that's why I think that's why I think that's why they released their beta early to ensure if there was anything wrong with it, it'll get fixed, you know. And they have they probably have fixed it. You know what I mean? So, well, I'm hoping they've fixed the problems anyway. So, so Battlefield 2042, it looked absolutely fantastic. It plays absolutely fantastic. But yeah, there is a few bugs. That shouldn't take more than a month to fix. Let's be honest, I shouldn't. I mean, they've had like three or four years of you know, to make the game, you know, so I don't think they need any more time, I mean, if it's, a, if it's a major bug that they can't fix, and it's inevitable they can't fix it, then yeah, they the, the, the probably will delay it, but until then, I don't think, th there's no excuse to delay it, you know, it's just easy bugs, that should be an easy fix. So you comment below, guys, do you think Battlefield 2042 should get delayed? Personally, I don't think it should, but obviously the game developers know more than me, if there's something that needs fixing, that'll take more time, then they'll probably delay it. So if you like the video, guys, please give it a like. If you're new to the channel, of course, please subscribe. Like, tell you a comment below. Do you think Battlefield should get delayed? I don't think it should. But we'll see what happens. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.